BMW. Uh, we'll be doing something a little bit different today. Um, I've got my hands on a Ford Fiesta Z Tech S. We are going to be doing some battles, so like hot hatch battles, something really different. Um, and at the moment we're kind of against the weather because I'd planned quite a bit today. Maybe we would have done some with a Volkswagen against the um, ST replica, uh, things like that. Because we've got two cars that are very, very similar to each other, similar sort of specs, same sort of uh, modifications. So that's kind of put us back a little bit because at the moment we've got some snow. Um, so yeah, that kind of sucks. We're going to do a bit of point view and uh, let's see if we make it to the next, like, next destination. I'll quickly just walk you around a few modifications. Uh, as you can see from the front, you've got eyelids and you've got a debadged grille. Uh, you've got the bonnet vents. Let's take you slowly around the vehicle. You've got BBS replica wheels with bright yellow, um, what's it called, brake calipers. AP coilovers, 15 inch wheels. The ST mirrors, the ST skirts, wind deflectors. All budget sort of build. I like everything on a budget. Got ST rear bumper. Bought this one, it was a um, damaged one, and I've repaired it, painted it. The lower splitters are actually from a Sayer IB for FR, and I've just chopped it to make them fit. Uh, you got a Hornet exhaust that is actually from a diesel, so it's a little bit more muffled rather than the other. I've got up top the ST uh, Mark 6 Fiesta, um, what's it called? Uh, spoiler. And then inside, we have a lot of mess at the moment, but it's a daily with ST seats all stripped out around the back. We've got a lovely double din stereo. We've got no modifications to the engines whatsoever at the moment. Now, time for some point of view. Not to 60.
I forgot to mention earlier that we've actually got a um, strut bar in there as well so it's quite stiff on the front and I find the back end sort of steps out a little bit but I'll be honest with you it's not too bad for a little front wheel drive car it's got some poke behind it 